In the studio, we've got Rutger again. And as a popular tech blogger, he's totally into drones. Rutger is sharing with us the most spectacular trends at the moment. Rutger, drones are not only used to spy on celebrities like they do in Hollywood, right? Yeah, that's, that's correct. Um, but um, going back to drones, the last news I heard uh, is that GoPro will soon be manufacturing drones. So that's really cool news and excited, of course. But drones are already more than just a gadget. Like, uh, some of them can literally save lives. For instance, in Germany, you have a post-order company uh, that brings medicines to regions that are hard to reach. And here in Holland, we have the ambulance drone from Ali Maman with some life-saving gear on board. Yes, I've heard of that drone, cool story. But what about drones in the field of gadgets, like, like the GoPro? Like, um, yeah, there are a few options. Um, but one is like the amazing new thing is the Parrot Beepop. Uh, Parrot combines with this flying device, uh, a drone with virtual reality. So when you connect the Oculus Rift or uh, uh, other VR glasses to the drone, you can see everything the 180 degrees fisheye lens films in full HD right to your retina. Uh, and I think that's an awesome experience. Sounds like a great Christmas present. We have time for one more. Can you share some hot trending topic? Yeah, right. Um, I think the last one is, for example, the brand new Inspire One. Uh, the guys from uh, um, DJI uh, developed a drone with a serious 4K camera on board. So think about what kind of great nature movies you can make with this drone. Um, or from your happy dog, of course, when he's running off the beach. <laughs> And uh, another nice detail uh, is that you operate the drone and the camera separately, so you can take your body out uh, and create some great stuff together. Okay, okay, and what price range should we think of? Uh, the last one, the, the Inspire One, you should think of like around 2,500 euros. Uh, I may talk about drones like the Parrot Beepop. Uh, they are cheaper, I think it's around 500 euros, but that's uh, including um, the VR glass. Thanks for your advice, Rutger, and uh, for the latest trends, check the website once.nl and follow.